Missy is lagging behind, running her hands over the tunnel walls. Here, what are you doing? Um, I need to settle on a voice for her, don't I? Looking for secret doors. Is it in a dungeon? Okay, looking for secret passages, like this one. There could be treasure. <laughs> Missy is lagging behind. She's still on Twitch. Jennifer looks back at us. We don't have time for this. We need to get go short on. Our, we need to go sort out those shields. Yes, but can't we bring back treasure too? Okay, let's. Pete says Jennifer's right. We need to stay focused. Yeah, that's uh, not an interesting secret door anyway. Okay, right. Okay, let's beat these up quickly. Nani oh. Right, these ones aren't so bad. Which makes me think they do something weird that we haven't know we don't know about yet. Nice big damage there! Oh, didn't mean to do that. Alright, slap. Uh, there we go. Okay, let's get out of here. Right. Right, we can't go that way. I have a nasty feeling we're gonna have to fight that thing before we get out. We allowed to go any further. If we move carefully, we can edge past the hole. We're good. Let's just have a quick look around here, but no, it's yeah. We ain't going anywhere. These at least aren't that big a problem. Fujimoto apparently has become the first victim. I'm not entirely certain what of. And I'm probably going to be really scared if I find out. So, I'm just not going to ask. Go well, that was a waste of time, wasn't it? Okay, alright. Snap! Oh, how many, how many points this thing got? More than nine. Oh, another thrill. There we go. Okay. Come oh, on, you can kill the sink. Or apparently not. There, finally. Alright, uh, pizza's leveled up. Okay, pizza! Uh, oh, we got new attack, self doubt. Cutting word weakens the enemy's resolve. Uh, accuracy down five, invasion down two. That's nice. Okay, but I think. That's the opponent in punch there. There we go. Light changes. It has all the points, Simon.
<laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> I tired of my plane is not working and it's showing. Oh dear. Oh. Get a martial artist in here, so we'll swap you out for. I think Andrew was an interesting fighter. What is the stink ball? No, you weren't. Okay. Oh, come on. Alright, let's try the special out. Slide with it. Oh, wow. Oh, well, I think we're going to have to work hard to get these guys to use special powers. Ballista, let's get rid of these guys. All right, fruit bat first. Oh, would you believe it? It dodged. Special acid strip. Alright, let's see if that'll work. Yeah, right. Down. Yeah, I was possibly thinking of that, but uh Alright, swap you out for who's the leader? Jennifer, I think it is. Uh, first aid on Heather. There we go. Excellent job! And let's actually let's swap you out for a minute. Let's swap you for yeah, Nicole and let's just good old fashioned mage them to death. Okay. Right. Okay. And every time after the fight I put my hands on the wrong set of keys, it's really actually quite annoying. Right, let's get out of here. Make me move carefully. We skirt past the hole. Right, I think we're gonna have to try and have a chat with this guy. So, guys, fingers crossed. <sighs> Question: If somebody wanted to make a plushie of a certain beautiful blue skindinian, only one, not to be mass produced, would that person have to get permission from the creator of Magical Diamond? Technically, yes, in all honesty, I don't think anyone would ever care. If you wanted to start giving one to Seiki and or Sidarian, then perhaps you ought to ask them first. It doesn't seem to notice us. Alright, let's leave it alone. Let's have one more loop around here and see if we can work out what we need to do. We can't go that way. Um, we didn't explore all the way through this tunnel, so let's try that. See if that makes a difference. Yeah! Oh, I don't like the fact that those things hit the size. Come on. I think things in this game dodge too much. I uh, both ways. There we go, one down. And let's get rid of the other one. Punch, kick. Snore at, though she'll never admit she snores. Good work, guys. Good work. What's down here? Are these, I don't think we fought these ones yet. Let's try it. Sneak past them. There we go. Brilliant. Okay. Nicole, you're. 
actually, I think what we're going to do is we're going to, we're going to swap Nicole out for a little bit because these guys don't actually that tough. And that will give her a chance to charge up. So we'll I'll use her when she when we uh, actually need her magic. There we go. These guys aren't that tough. So I just need to do these. Hopefully we'll find a bit more story. Just talking about my singing. Though that was fairly awful as well. Oh look, there we go, that's where we need to go. Okay, actually that's let's hypnotize right back. Thank you very much. You are so very kind, other word princess. Yeah, that's the problem with these lagoons. Uh, once they open up, they can explode. But they're fairly easy to kill. Right, now let's get rid of the sleepy mind worm. I love the story of this game. I want to get to some more of it. There we go. Jennifer has leveled up. Okay, so she's gone. This is our first aider, and in fact, I think what we need is actually a pern in first aid for this one. So now, yet yeah, she now recover heals a lot more. It shall be good for us. Yeah, I haven't seen much of Damien recently. Possibly because I'm right behind you, Simon. Just a thought. Okay. Alright. You're go you're going the wrong way. We'll just check out the end of this tunnel, okay? Jennifer sighs heavily. There's a large hole in the floor up ahead. We carefully approach it. The bottom is only a few feet below us. And the hole is full of ethereous legumes. Oh, good lord. And this is why we've been saving up Nicole's attacks. Right, swap. And... Fireball, or... Let's fireball them. Yep, that was enough. <laughs> okay. Nice. They are, aren't they? Defeated, the vines sink into quiescence. The hole is full of the seeds they scattered. Look, alien seeds! Jennifer hugs Missy tightly. You're right, there is a treasure here. We can take these home and grow our own. And I'll get to be the first scientist to describe them. If we raise them, they might imprint on us like ducklings. We could do our own monster armies. No. Why not? I'm bringing them back to study, not to conquer the world. They aren't coming out of the freezer until I have a containment facility ready. Yeah, I picked up. I picked up. Well, I picked a few voices, and I. I still need to talk to um, Laura but that will be happening soon we're going to sneak past these guys right it looks like this isn't the way forward sneak past them again uh, we've gone up the top let's just go down here 
Okay, so it looks like let's... Well, let's do the sensible thing. Let's save, shall we?